660. Today we're going to look at a pretty cool new product that was sent to me by Kimimoto. Uh, these are <clears throat> heated glove liners and here is what they got shipped to me here. Let's take a look. So here's what is in the bag. You get a 110 charging cable and it splits off into two right here because you have two batteries because you have two hands most people do so you can charge both of these at the same time <clears throat> all right let's take a look inside this bag let's set this to the side now keep in mind these are just glove liners so if you are just walking around not riding the bike <clears throat> you could wear these and uh, keep your hands warm but if you're on the bike and you're riding you're going to need uh, outer layer glove that uh, wind protection and that way it will hold in the heat all right let's uh, install one of these batteries here we've got the left glove i don't think it matters which battery goes in which one there and we're just going to tuck that back in zip it up and then we just hold that button till it lights up There's lit up red, so we have three levels, I think. Red is the hottest, white being medium, and blue is the low setting. And we're back to red. <clears throat> All right, so you do have a Velcro cuff. Woo, that is pretty strong Velcro there. <clears throat> I have size extra large, and they fit very well. All my gloves are extra large and these fit just fine so now you just get it to comfort here it goes up quite a ways so it's going to tuck in under your jacket and uh very nice so the battery is down here you don't even really notice the battery and uh <clears throat> i just turned these on it hasn't even been a minute yet and i can already feel the heat from these gloves so let's let's add these are just my kind of summertime riding gloves here i'm just going to put them right on over again these are extra large and they fit right over these glove inserts that's what's nice about these inserts is they're so soft kind of a thinner material which is why you need to add an outer glove to it but it's able to fit inside of your normal riding gloves man that is so warm already that is uh that's pretty wild how it is heating up that quickly already and once you add your outer glove it really holds in the heat and you really start feeling the warmth from that glove now if you put on a winter glove over this I mean it's going to be even that much warmer right all right so the next step to do is uh, we're going to get the right hand glove going and then we're going to get out on the road Well, these uh, heated uh, glove inserts are working very well. I don't think I'm going to be using them on the way back because it's warm and uh, just too too much too much heat. This is going to be great for uh, winter time when it gets cooler, 60 and below. Thank you. 
Well, somehow these gloves got on uh, the low setting and they were still toasty warm, even on the low. Ooh, on the end of that ride, I was taking my gloves off and I noticed that the setting had turned to low setting. I think what happened was when I was putting my jacket on over, I was hitting the button, so you gotta be mindful of that. But even on the low setting, on that long ride, my hands were literally sweating. It was, it was just too hot. I mean, the temperature outside was about 65 to 67 degrees, which you really don't need heated gloves for that temperature, but I wanted to test them out, and man, they really work good. These are gonna be great at uh, 60 degrees and below. Uh, those cold days, just remember, put your over glove on it to block out the wind and look right here on the two fingers and the thumb that is so you can operate your touch screen devices very cool <clears throat> all right kimimoto heated glove insert man for the wind those are pretty nice i'm going to leave a link in the description box below in case you need want to pick up yours today